In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to add images to Game Salad and really start to customize your games to make them exactly what you want them to be. So if you want to make an actor, for example, that is an image of something besides just a square or a rectangle, you're going to first go to your Images tab in the Library palette, and you'll see the standard plus button that Game Salad uses that will allow you to add an image to your project. So I'm going to click that. We're actually going to add an image. Let me go to my desktop, and this is a standard browser. So I'm going to go into my folder. I have a graphics folder, and I'm going to add some elements. Game Salad offers on their website things they call croutons. There's some free graphics you can use in your games, and that's what I'm going to be adding here. I'm going to add a character, the submarine, from their ocean crouton pack. So I'm just going to click that. There's what it's going to look like. When I click open, you'll see it's added to the images window. In this images window, you can adjust the size of your preview. That's just for your customization, whatever works for you. Now there's a couple different ways you can take this image and make it into an actor. The simplest way to do that is to just grab this image right here and drag it up into the Actors tab of the Inspector palette. And Game Salad automatically creates a new actor for you named with the image name with that image used for the actor. Now if you did start, say you created an actor from scratch. Now, let me delete this demo actor and say I added a new actor by pressing the plus sign here. I could also take this image and just drag it right on top of that actor I've previously created. And now that actor will have the new image applied to it. Now of course, you can take this actor, this submarine in our case, drag it, drop it right on your window, and there's your actor ready to go in the game. You could add some behaviors to this. You could make it move across the screen. You could add some more actors so you can press maybe the space bar and, and shoot torpedoes out of this submarine. Whatever your game's going to be. Now that's it for this lesson. That's how easy it is to import and add images to your projects in Game Salad.